Hey everyone, Tupa here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are sailing on the beautiful Caribbean princess on an Eastern Caribbean cruise. I do have to say that Princess Cruise Lines is one of our favorite cruise lines. We haven't tried them all yet, so we are trying. But I'd like to give lots of tips and tricks um, as we go along. And the first one is when you go on board is to not take those main elevators. Veer off to the left or the right, either go forward or aft and get on those elevators because there's no line. And my next tip is to carry your swimsuits in your carry-on so that you can enjoy the pool and the hot tubs while everyone else is embarking. If you do get an early boarding time, you'll have time to enjoy the pools and hot tubs and have time to tour the ship before your cabin is ready. This is the aft pool, which is adults only, and the outriggers bar, which this is beautiful when you're under sail. And this beautiful medallion class ship means that you order your medallions, everything is done on your phone with your app. You can wear your medallion however you like. No key cards, you just walk up to your door and it unlocks for you. The cabins are beautiful. This is a balcony cabin. I did do a cabin tips and tricks. I'll leave that link right up here, but I forgot to mention since she is an older ship, if you have a lot of electronics to plug in, you'll need an extension cord without a surge protector like this one. So once you're checked in, drop off everything in your cabin. You check out the Princess Pattern, which will give you the list of entertainment. Don't forget to check into your muster station and off you go to take a tour. What's nice with all the bars on the ship, they now have these QR codes everywhere. So you scan that. It will bring up the menu for the bar and you can choose what you like, either order on the app or walk right up and place your order. And now we're off to the sanctuary pool. Many people don't know you, there is a fee to use the sanctuary either a half day or a full day, but the sanctuary pool is actually an adults only pool. And one of the good things about this, this is one of the only pools that has full steps all the way into the pool. So if you do have any mobility issues, this is the pool for you. You can just walk all the way into the pool and not have to worry about climbing in and out. And why you ask I'm worried about that? Well, this was me on this cruise. <laughs> the sanctuary pool also has two hot tubs and a thermal suite in the spa right next door, which we did really enjoy. And because she is an older ship, this thermal suite is one of the smaller thermal suites in the fleet, but is still very relaxing. There are five heated stone beds. There are three saunas and two rainforest showers. And yes, there is a fee to use the thermal suite. Uh, there is a couple's discount, so do check that out if you are using the spa. And don't forget when it's time, go catch your sail away party. Now we have an agreement on board. We're selling at 40% capacity, so you need to make up in energy for the remaining 60%. Can you do that? Yeah. Let's try it again. Caribbean Princess, can you do that? Yeah. Well, let's do it if you want. And yes, sorry, had to mute this due to copyright. There are six ships departing today, and don't forget to set your phone to airplane mode or you'll come home to racked up charges. Our first night for dinner, of course we clean up kind of nice. We are never disappointed with princess food, loving the pistachio creme brulee. 
And in the evening, you will find us up on deck for Movies Under the Stars. This is where Princess brings out cushions, blankets. They'll even walk around with popcorn. It used to be first run movies, but now it's just movies. And if you want something more than just popcorn, you're close enough to the buffet to run in and grab some snacks for the movie. We are early risers, so having the balcony is such a fun thing in the morning. It's so peaceful and quiet. And one thing that has changed on the Caribbean Princess since last time is they put the coffee and cones on the Lido deck. And this is where we met Max. Love Max! Thank you. Tomorrow you come, you yeah. get another picture, okay? Thanks. Oh, and Max did not disappoint, because our last day, the picture was amazing. And this day we are sailing into Princess Keys, or Princess Kays, however you'd like to say it. This beautiful Bahamas island is Princess Own Island, and you do have to take a ferry to go over. Now once you get off the ferry, you can either go left or right. We chose Little Bay only because I was in a boot on this on this trip. So we did get a clamshell with chairs, which is nice because most of the chairs do not have any shade and the shade is kind of few and far between since it's just palms on the beach. And yes, you can carry your towels off the ship. But what an amazing view. Back on the ship, a new fun thing with the Medallion app is games around the pool. take a small tour of the atrium and then we're gonna jump down to the plaza deck here's where you can see that princess is more of an ocean liner cruise on plaza deck 5 you will find the island dining room which is one of the main dining rooms here on the left and then you'll find the Good Spirits Bar, which is a great place to find some new drinks. The bartender's always friendly. And then you'll also find the International Cafe. So here they do have morning coffee. Your baristas are here. If you have the beverage package, this coffee is included. If you don't have the beverage package, this coffee is a fee. But all the snacks, which uh, breakfast snacks have lots of donuts and breads and pastries they are included and so is lunch they have lots of great quick sandwiches and salads for lunch this is included in your cruise fare and then you have the vines bar which does do wine tastings if you like for a fee and around the corner next to vines is the vines uh, duty-free store and then you'll have your internet cafe and any help if you need help with your medallion app you come down here to the internet cafe well that's it for now for this beautiful caribbean princess ship we're off to St. Kitts next time. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. I am trying to get my first 1,000 subscribers. And don't forget to do more of what makes you happy.